to this in the evening. It's around 7 p.m. We've finally unpacked everything and the budget truck is put back. So we have everything in the garage and in various other places in the house. We are living in the woodshed. <laughs> That's the part of the house that the guy used to do a bunch of different woodworking projects and stuff. But here's the property. We got some little tables out here. We love to sit out here. We'll be moving those to the patio in the back eventually. This is the guest quarters and bottom floor is old wood shop. Um, we're going to change this into guest quarters. Um, but I wanted to do a walkthrough so you can see how ugly this place is. Okay, so this is our garage full of all our stuff while we're working. This is all going to be changed, so I want you guys to see what it's like before we change every single thing. Floors stink. Wish there were smell of vision. Seriously. It's so bad. We have fans on everywhere because we have no AC. Windows open, fans on. We ripped out the rugs in here. Um, this is all going to change. Everything is a mess, people. We need to just think about how ugly this is. How ugly all these old carpets are and cupboards and gross. I wish you could just smell the carpets. I really wish you could. Um, it's a little bit dark in here. I don't know where the light is. I don't even know where all the lights are. <laughs> Take a look at this. This is where we're camped out in for right now. Doing our stuff. But, I mean, you have iron in the water. Stains. Which is funny because it's not stained there. Which is interesting. Um, but that's our bathroom. Everything's going to be changed. Look, we got this fancy cardboard up here. Because we uh, don't want to be seen while we're going to the potty. So here we go, these three rooms. We've taken carpet out. This is Ryan's future office. This is our future bedroom suite. We're going to combine these two rooms. Okay. These two rooms are going to be combined. And there is a bathroom in here. For the master suite, this bathroom is incredibly small. Look. Look at that. It's incredibly small. So what we're going to do is we're going to, and there's a crazy little closet, we're going to break into this guest bath. We're going to break in here, backside, make this smaller, and we're going to combine these two rooms for a master suite. And back here you can actually see down to the water, down to the ocean. So this is where I kind of want my bedroom. Oh, let's focusing okay and I'm probably gonna put my bathroom back there on the front of the house because I don't really care about my view in my bathroom okay this is the next area we're going down the stairs look at this we got this amazing I don't even know what, <laughs> I don't know what you call it I'm not well versed in this yep this came with the house super fancy there's a, there's a pup for the dogs. Okay, we took all the rugs out down here. So this is all glue and old padding that's stuck. This is the laundry room. Okay. And our plans are to combine. Oh, look at this bathroom. It's so hilarious. So when you sit on this potty here, if you're tall enough, you may touch the wall with your knees. I mean, this doesn't even do it justice. The video makes it look way wider. Look, there's my hand at the end of the toilet. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Guys, it's nuts. Um, so anyway, our plan here, we're going to combine this bathroom with this laundry room. We're going to make it a big bathroom laundry room together because this is where we're going to come in if we're going to be playing on the beach. So we want people to have benches here. Um, to sit down and undress and take a shower if they want to wash off all the salt water and have the laundry room in here too so they can throw all their dirty crap in there that they bring from outside. Maybe they got stuck in the mud and they got to throw it in there. Um, so that's what we want to do there. This back room here will be my daughter's room. Um, it actually ends up being the only room that's not so stinky like must. Um, 
Um, and that's just the main thing. This uh, bottom floor ends up being pretty tight, air, uh, watertight, so it's not too bad. But in Maine, it gets so humid that um, even in your cellar area, it'll smell a little musty just because you have so much condensation. And I'll show you that if I can. Uh, Sophie, come on, puppy. Little dog. It's stuck in the room. Uh, right now, our friend that helped us move, he is sleeping in here. Um, and we got him this little blow up bed. I don't know how nice it is, but I feel awful that he has to sleep on that. But that's what he signed up for. He knew it was going to be nuts. Um, this color, I mean, this, this rug came free, guys. Look at that. I mean, isn't that fancy? It's wicked awesome. So we, this my, this will be my son's room. And so I'll tell you what our plans are real quick here. So we plan to break into this wall all the way to the back three feet, push it in three feet. We're going to make our staircase wider and we're going to make the staircase come here because right now the stairs are pretty steep. Uh, we're going to have them come out here more. This whole wall is going to be gone right here. This whole wall is going to be gone. So when you walk down the stairs, you have a nice open area instead of a doorway going into another room. So this room um all of this this whole wall this bedroom was interesting it has it has like a hallway included in the bedroom so what we're going to do is the door is going to be there for my son's room everything from there forward is going to be our utility room because that's what this is and this is where i might be able to show you how condensation works here in maine when it's super muggy look at that this is all very, very normal <laughs> for Maine. Look at that. Uh, so we have what we're going to do. We're going to get a hot water in here that also has a dehumidifier on it. That'll help out a lot. But this is just very common in Maine. I mean, it just gets real muggy in the summer. So that's what we're dealing with. So that's just going to be all the utility room. Okay. So this is going to be a wall here. We're going to have a little door for the utility room. This won't be here anymore, it'll just be one. So I had to stop the video earlier because my phone doesn't have a lot of space. So I was saying that this is going to be our utility room. This, you're, going to, you're going to enter the utility room from here. That's going to be a wall and it's going to break in here to the utility room. That's going to be my son's room and you're going to access it from here because the stairs are going to be brought over here because remember we're pushing this three feet that way. Um, so that's what is happening and I'll go in here. I don't think the last video I showed you kind of what we're doing in here. So right now, um, we're going to be living down here. It's musty smelling and everything, but we're going to be living down here while we have construction upstairs. Um, so I'm going to have, you know, a hot plate, a microwave and just maybe a Instapot. We'll be eating pretty simple for a while, but see, this is an add-on. This used to be the outside wall to the house, and so they put kind of a sunroom on the back. And so we plan to, oh, we're locked in here. We plan to demo all this. Um, the foundation needs to be fixed. I'll show you that in a minute. But first off, what we're gonna do here is we're gonna have sliding glass walls. Um, and we're going to put a special beam up so we can do this. It, it will be, um, I don't know if my husband wants it. No, he does. He wants um, a sliding glass wall to be here and a sliding wall to happen here. Um, so it's just all going to be glass walls. Uh, very cool. Um, and actually in here will end up being um, our TV theater room. Um, I think this might be the wall that we're watching. The TV on I don't remember maybe this wall <laughs> but we're gonna have a nice you know flat gray uh, wall to have the best um, projector TV there and it'll be fun it'll be the only TV in the house okay so now I'll show you the foundation issues we're having so this was this is an entrance they made in the add-on for their own uh, kind of space where they kept their uh, lawnmower and everything because they have a little garage door right here and it opens up out back um, and they have a big oil tank we're gonna get rid of that um, but look at this foundation issue guys look at this I mean it's terrible this 
real bad, uh, all kinds of mold, everything, just really bad. Look it up in there. We need to fix electrical, plumbing, uh, but most importantly, this whole wall is shot. Um, and I'll show you what happened outside to get it that way. Behind this wall is a set of concrete stairs, and they didn't act. They didn't. They didn't first off secure this to this wall, um, and uh, condensation and all kinds of rainwater and everything got behind the stairs that are on the back side of this, the concrete stairs, and it froze and it busted the, the whole side of this place. So they're going to have to pump up with a jack the whole side of this house and fill in um, a new wall here and connect it properly. And we're actually going to concrete this wall over too and this wall. Um, so this will be like our canning area, our uh, wine cellar. Um, so that'll be really cool. But I just want to see, wanted you to see how rough this is. We'll go out the sun door here. So remember, this is all going to be sliding doors and it's going to open up to a patio. Um, we're going to take out all this, re-patio everything, make a beautiful area with a cover, somehow, some maybe some sort of pergola. This lovely uh, thing will be gone. <laughs> all this junk will be gone. They have all kinds of junk here. Um, this will be gone. Uh, everything was done here um, in a terrible way. They didn't accurately drain um, the property down. So there are some wet spots in the property. For instance, over here, you're always sopping wet here. So there's no good drainage happening. So that'll all be fixed. Um, but then I will show you the foundation issue on this side. So see here, these are the concrete stairs and they go behind that wall that I just showed you and tons of liquid got in here and it frosted and everyone who lives in Maine knows that can happen because <laughs> when water freezes, it pushes things apart. So um, pretty bad, uh, pretty bad area. We're going to tear out all this. I'm going to tear out this. I know I have, <laughs> I have some family members that want this, this bush here. Um, so we're going to do significant work on the outside um, concerning drainage and we're going to have steps going down this way instead. Uh, nice natural looking granite steps. Nothing nasty like this. This just looks like it looks like Fort Knox gone bad. <laughs> I don't know. So bad. But we're going to do um, totally new siding, some shaker uh, vinyl uh, shingle siding. All new windows. I don't want windows with little pockets in them. I don't even know what you guys call them. What do you call them? Um, so I like to wash my window and have just a full window. That's what I'm going to have. So we're going to also do raised seam roof. Um, the roof on this is awful. Obviously, everything's awful on this. Um, so new siding, new roof, uh, new windows all around. And that is, that is the story so far. Um, we're going to finish the house first and then we will tackle this guy. Um, this will be my husband's shop on the bottom. I'll, I'll show you guys that. So this will be the shop that we have. Um, you know, a nice man space. Um, so it's nice. Upstairs, we are going to take these stairs out have access from outside, have a private access to the top of this floor. And we're just gonna make it, look at what we have here. Looks like the spider cut something great. Good lunch. So we're gonna go ahead and make this space a guest quarters up here. Look, look how up it is. It will be transformed, that's for sure. We'll have a little kitchenette, little toilet, shower, um, and we'll have a beautiful little living area. And then on the back side, this is where the entrance will be, probably, probably from out here. Um, the ent entrance will be up here, we'll have some stairs going up, and we're going to have a patio going out the back. Um, I'm not quite sure how he's going to do that with the roof. I haven't any idea, but we'll have a patio, and it will be very, very nice. Okay. 